Okay, so in this video, nitaenda kukuonyesha namna gani unaweza ku verify account yako, especially pale unapokuwa pengine imekataliwa au kuna changamoto fulani hivi. Kitu cha kwanza ambacho unatakiwa ujue, uh, una verify vitu viwili. Kuna identity pamoja na address of residence, okay? Identity tuna verify we ni nani? Maana yake document tunayo ya prod lazima iwe na picha. Sina maana kwamba unaweza uka, uka prod document yoyote no. Hapa lazima uwe na maybe national for, national ID, okay? passport driving license vitu vyote ambavyo doc card zote because it is an identity card card yote ile ambayo inaonyesha ina verify kwamba ni wewe maana yake ina majina yako yalivyo sawa pengine na signature pale na picha inatalea kuzaliwa okay hivyo ndio vitu ambavyo tuna verify kwamba ni wewe okay that means kama umetuma kama umetumia jina Juma Bahati alafu uka upload ID ya shula that means hawezi wakakubali okay au majina yakatofautiana that's why watu wanapokuja kwangu ku verify huwa nawauliza majina kama yalivyo kwenye kwenye ID ili unapokuja ku verify kwenye address of residence pia unatakuwa ku upload majina okay na sanduku la posta you are hapa kwenye address of residence verification una verify address unakaa wapi that means bila sanduku la posta uwezi ka verify because some people wanauliza kwamba okay maybe uh, mimi sina sanduku la posta na verify vipi lazima uwe na sanduku la posta liwe la kanisani la msikiti la shule hivi popote pale ambapo upo ili verify kwamba upo maeneo hayo so lazima liwe la kwako understood so for example in this guy um yeye amefaulu verify identity card lakini amekuja kuferi kwenye address of residence verification. Na reason ya kwa nini imekataliwa? Unaweza kuona ameapproved ame several times, many many times, okay? Many many times. Uh, na tatizo kubwa ni kwamba address ambayo aliandika huku ni tofauti na ambayo ipo kwenye document aliyotumia ku, ku verify, okay? That means how are we going to solve this? So utaenda kwenye profile, utaenda verification. Uh, itakuja huku Uh, hapa kwenye address let's click details tuone shida ilikuwa nini let's see load is sana okay Let us click it again. Uh, in a road is sana hapo kwenye address. Ngoja tuone. Okay? Nimekuja. So ikishakuja hapa, that means you have to upload ile address. Sasa so, before you upload kwa kawaida huwa tukiupload unakuja just uh, sorry sorry. Unakuja sasa hivi andikwa blows here. Okay? kisha bonyeza bro blows na kupeleka moja kwa moja kwenye document yako umeiweka wapi okay that is that is normal okay lakini this guy kuna changamoto ya address kuna changamoto ya address address ambayo kaitumia is different nataka niwaonyeshe address ambayo ameitumia ni tofauti na address ambayo tunataka kuitumia So address alitumia address tofauti. Unapotumia address tofauti maana yake nini? Uh, maana yake ni kwamba una verify residence ambayo sio yako. Kama huku kwa broker umeandika address fulani utakuwa kuandika ile ile. So you have to come and change that address. Kwa mfano huyu jamaa kwenye address kaweka namba ya simu. See that problem. Kwenye address kaweka namba ya simu. So wana, wana verify VIP address na ninavyokutumia mimi document ya ku verify always na kutumia ikiwa na same address you have to copy the way it is okay na kama uja verify pia unahitaji ku verify you can find me on my whatsapp number 0754985520 so this guy address haikuwa hii so unapotaka kubadili address what you have to do nenda kwenye uh, profile then click personal data then itakuja hapa Then ukitaka ku change address click hapa change uh, ita load 
Okay. So these are the mistakes ambazo watu wanafanya. Imagine mtu ana upload affidavit kwenye identity verification. What do you want to verify? You are not verifying your identity. Hapo. Affidavit is where you verify identity in a verify uh, residence, okay? That is very important. Ata ben statement pia. So city here uh, tutaandika gator because that is what was supposed to be hapa ilikuwa ni tano na moja that document tano na moja ilikuwa tano na moja then we had ilikuwa na tano na moja alafu gate okay uh, then select image twende moja kwa moja to verify kabisa uh, so here let's go to documents documents which is here let's click send we saw here it on pdf so it is loading okay so make sure naandika kama ile hiyo city naandika gate because that document ambayo nakutumia inakuwa na sehemu ya city address na country you copy the way imeandikwa pale so majina pia lazima yafanane because kwenye ile document na sehemu ya majina kama unaitwa Joseph G Juma andika hivyo kama unaitwa Joseph Gilvers Juma andika hivyo okay you have to copy everything usianze kuweka vifupisho wakati kwenye ID kule jina halina vifupisho okay nime change ila i see the same number ina appear hapa uh, maybe because is this still loading? Where to load it? Here now to one. Kunamda kunakuwa na shida tu ya mtandao. It happens. It happens. Sometimes it happens. Not to care that. Huh? You have already created the liquidity, please wait until it is. So tayari wamesha ipokea kule, so we are waiting for the answers. We are waiting for the answers. So tayari tumesha upload document usika. Okay? So tunasubiri majibu yao. Okay, so leo ni tale nane still. So unezu kaje pia kama unawasuwasi, unezu kaje hapa, uka upload tena yo document. Don't worry, hakuna shida yoyote. Okay? Hakuna shida yoyote. Hakuna shida yoyote. So that is the easiest way ya kuweza ku verify. Make sure tu unafata vigezo na masharti. Na ukienda kinyume, they want uh, wezo wakakubali. Na utakutua na vitu kama hivi. Cancel, cancel, cancel. Wanakata zote, zote, verification zote. Ambazo utakua umeweka. So you can see the document ipo kwenye pending so tunasubiri hawaweze ku verify so guys have a nice day kama unahitaji document ya ku verify just check me on whatsapp as usual